So this is day two of our little DeVos adventure. If you haven't seen day one, just go back, watch that first. I explain the race format and stuff. We ended up pretty good after day one, so we started pretty early for day two. I still forgot to film the start and everything like that, but this is the first lift up to stage one. And as you can see, quite a bit of snow fell since yesterday. And just to warn you to start with, I'm gonna moan a lot about the views because they were wow. truly amazing. What? I'm not gonna lie, this is probably one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. It was an amazing oh. transfer and it was so early in the morning. The sun had just gotten up. I, uh, it was just beautiful. <laughs> All right, this is probably the most scenic transfer ever. Right, for stage two, there's a funicular over there. Get that up to the top. Transfer all the way over there to the stage. All the way over that ridge. Uh, Shit. That's a ridge line now. Whoa. They are insanely hot. Oh. Oh. oh, look at this. What? Ah, oh. whoa. He told us yesterday that they had to start stage one further down. Well, this was supposed to be on a stage, so I think it's fair enough. Are we starting a bit further down? Alright. Danish guy is first on track. Boom. So this stage was pretty fun. It was a really good stage to start with. We were the first ones on the stage. So while we couldn't really see all the sneaky lines, but we couldn't catch up to anybody as well. So that was pretty nice. All right, I need to catch up to Bob. Oh yeah. Oh, tight. Ah. Do our phone is on. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so we are done after stage one. Yeah. And how did it go? Good, good. Pretty yeah. good. It was really good. It was a really fun trail and you saw the scenery at the top. It was amazing. The trail was really good. We were the first ones down it. I sent the Danish one the first one down the trail. But uh, there was nobody we could catch. We didn't get caught by Nick Beer. Well, because he punctured. But Whatever. Yeah. No snow. It, it was good though. It was uh, It was a solid stage. Yep. So yeah, now we need to go to the transfer. All right, it's only half past eight now and we already experienced a lot. More than I would experience in a week in Denmark. <laughs> So we got over across the valley and into the funicular, got that funicular up, and got on the other funicular to get all the way to the top. Wow. Again, the view was amazing. Holy. Oh. <sighs> wow. Die gegen fuck for Transfer to stage two and view. 
check. I think at the briefing they said that this transfer was supposed to be one and a half hour, something like that. But it was more like two and a half hours because we got so much snow. So it was really slow. We had to hike a lot of it. It's long, we're halfway I think. And um, well, we need to carry her back soon. There's a lot of snow. We out here, day five on the bikes. No food, no water. It's hot. Hey Fred. You want sneakers or what? Why are you sitting in the corner oh. already alone? Det er godt. Tjus godt nå. Vi giver dem altså før. Ja, yeah, tjus. Igen, det her dag var virkelig fun. Det var pretty open, og nogle corners du kunne cut a lot, så vi kind of... So we kind of didn't know what you can do, if you can cut them, or should you stick to the trail. So we stuck to the trail and might have lost some time there, but still it was pretty fun. Ew! <laughs> yeah! The dirt was so taggy up top because I guess it rained a lot and then the sun came out. So it was just perfect conditions. And then we came down into this a bit more rocky dirt. I don't fit that. Oh, careful. Fuck, oh, careful. I'm back. But this is stage 3, 4? 3. 3. Boom. So it was pretty much just downhill from stage 2 to stage 3. And um, I guess stage 3 was as stage 4 was on day 1. Just like an uphill stage. I guess they had to have one of those every day, apparently. The fuck? Because this was a pretty long uphill. And it just continued. And you can see my speed is not what it was. And then we came around the corner and it continued again. Not gonna lie, almost fell over here. I was so tired in my legs from pedaling up that hill. So getting to this like half technical section, it was pretty hard. Ah! Watch out! Finish! Ah! I just had lunch. And now we're going for the last stage, stage four. <laughs> stage four. Ooh. This is the stage today. So because there was so much snow on the transfer to stage two, they cancelled stage five, which you will see here it was pretty good for me and Bob. Stage 4 turned out to be the longest stage of the weekend, I think. The top was pretty flat, a bit technical with a lot of rocks, but so much fun. You really had to power through up in the rocks here in the top. Try to listen here. That is not a sound you want to hear, especially not followed by this. And that is a really bad sound. Ah. 
Hej, hey Pelle. So I hit my derelli on the rock, and it got into my spokes, so I couldn't really pedal. So from there on, it was a bit of uphill, a bit of flat, but it was not too bad. And after that, it was pretty much just downhill. And I was on a pumping mission just to pump through it all. This section of the trail was so much fun, so high speed, and it's pretty sick to think about that we were racing this blind, so we didn't know what was coming, but it was just so flowy, and you could carry so much speed, which was pretty good for me because I couldn't pedal. The stage also just kept on going. It was the longest stage of the weekend. It was over 10 minutes, that for sure just kept on going, it was so much fun. So we looked a bit under the times from this stage and people we normally rode the same times with, they were one or two minutes faster than us. So we lost a fair bit of time and that translated to three places in the overall standings on Sunday. So it was kind of a bummer. Fuck. <laughs> Det var i det mindste det rigtige sted, den snappede. Han skulle lige have gjort det. Lige lidt senere. Men i det mindste så nakkede den ikke nogen eger. Jeg nåede at stoppe inden. Um, og så i starten så sad den helt fast. Så gav han bare sådan en ordentlig hook. Og så kunne jeg alligevel sådan bevæge den sådan her. Så kunne jeg svinge ordentligt. Nice. So what was supposed to be stage 5, which is luckily was cancelled. <laughs> It was pretty much just flat and uphill, so we were pretty lucky. That chainless life. Well, not not chainless, the regular right, yes. So people are still coming in. Quick. Relax, relax. Sounds good, yeah. sounds good. Thanks for your answers. Nice having you here and enjoy oh, yeah. the rest of your day. Yeah, Thank you very much. So even though we felt like day two went way better than day one, we fell so much down the rankings. And I think we were like in eighth and ninth place after this, which was pretty strange because we think we wrote pretty good, except stage four, of course. I hope you like this video from day two. Stay tuned for day three and just have fun.